The financial management reporting system for Papua New Guinea parliamentarians is weak, says Mr. Maru. A quarterly or monthly report from the finance department is vital in the process of monitoring funds so that MPs and the district authorities are held accountable. Uh, I've registered that the government caucus has said every quarter of finance, all the ministers, members of parliament should get reports so we know exactly what's going on. We have no financial authority and we accept that. Yanguru Sausi District is among those others that have submitted the 2013 acquittals. Administrator Franz Tony Yanin and B4 presenting the acquittals to Implementation Rural Development Departmental Head Paul Sai highlighted the importance of reconciling bank statements. Bank reconciliation is the only way to confirm my fund balances. So my ledgers do not match uh, with the cash, 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 cash in the bank. Mr. Sai in response spoke about the reporting system that must be improved to strengthen capacity building programs for accountability, good governance and transparency. One of the big issues is really complying to the guidelines. Of legal guidelines is one program that has a guideline, the DSIP or the report of the SIP program. Young Guru Sausi was provided 23 million kina, 18.7 million kina was dispersed. 4.3 million kina rolled over into 2014. Fabian Hakalitz, National MTV News.